This is kind of a supplementary lesson. In your book, you'll see songs like Inchworm and Vitamin C and Inchworm 2. However, the buzzing speed for those require a slow buzz and then a slide all the way out to position six. Everybody's mouth shape is a little different and sometimes people have difficulty slowing the buzzing down to those low notes. So if you're one of those people who prefers the high notes or just want to supplement with higher notes, I'm going to play them through without the backing track, but I'm going to play them at a higher pitch. And those notes are going to be E flat in third position just before the bell. This is called the bell. And first position. So where we were going one, six, one, six. Now we're going to go three, one, three, one with faster buzzing. It sounds like this. So it's the same higher and lower of the pitch that forms that inchworm. That's where I created the name for it. It just struck me that it was the movement of an inchworm. But it's just using E flat and F for position three and one. So let's try it again. Ready? One, two, three. So there's no vitamin E flat, but maybe vitamin E is the, uh, the next one. So here we go on vitamin E. One, two, three. to the D, which we've used in vitamin C. So I'm going to play that for you one more time. This is vitamin E, position three and one. And then there's one spot where you're on position four. One, two, three. Uh. One, two, three. Uh. So that is vitamin E. And here's inchworm two. And this is the one that goes higher because you're going to start on position one and four with even faster buzzing. It sounds like this. So that was going from F to a note called G in fourth position. And this is only for people that really prefer that faster buzzing. So let's try that again. One, two, three. So that is a supplementary lesson if you are feeling comfortable playing faster notes or faster buzzing notes.